Well, hi. Uh, good morning, First Christian Church. And uh, it is Wednesday morning. It is just right about 10 o'clock. And uh, I am in downtown West Point uh, doing my weekly update uh, where uh, I try to highlight new stores or new things that are happening or old stores or whatever the case may be. And as I'm down here, uh, there is work that's being done to my right, which uh, is where Magnolia is. And they are doing some work on the Ritz building down there. Um, uh, and uh, I happen to be standing in front of uh, the, the bank. Uh, Dovey Janes and uh, uh, there's there's people inside and they're cutting hair and everything but uh, that's not the one I'm trying to highlight today well I am gonna highlight them too but uh, I see that door right above it it says uh, Mossy Oak property so I don't know if they closed the store that was down there by the Mossy Oak uh, the, the the big store down there off of 45 uh, I, I know that some of them are working over here now. I guess they're upstairs, but uh, Mossy Oak Properties, downtown West Point, you got a place that you can stop in and check out all the inventory, check out all the land that's for sale. Uh, I know that they helped us with our property, and uh, so that's what's happening. So Mossy Oak Properties, uh, right here behind me, is come on in, check them out, and get your hair cut when you go downstairs. It's, just, it's pretty cool. All right. Um, hi there. Uh, so... All right, so some of the announcements for this week. Oh. I'm not <laughs> Okay. Uh, there's a gentleman here getting a number. So uh, anyway, um, so this week, okay, uh, of course, this Sunday is Mother's Day. Uh, we will be having the Brotherhood Breakfast at 730. So uh, make sure that you swing by the Brotherhood Breakfast men uh, on Mother's Day uh, to have the breakfast. Uh, that'll be at 7.30. Of course, we are having our, our uh, Sunday school at 9.45, 11 o'clock worship service. And then, but that, because it is Mother's Day, there will be no Sunday evening service this week. All right, so no Sunday evening this Sunday. Now, next Sunday uh, is going to be a song service. And uh, we're going to do lots and lots of songs. We'll have communion. Uh, of course, we'll have uh, the announcements but lots and lots of songs, a very short message, and uh, that'll be next Sunday. Not this Sunday, but next Sunday. And, of course, we'll resume our Sunday evening at that point as well. Where are we this week, though? Where are we this week in reading the Bible? Well, we are upon two books that I personally absolutely adore. And... They are in 1 Timothy and 2 Timothy. Read 1 Timothy and 2 Timothy. 1 Timothy and 2 Timothy. Read them both for Sunday. Now, why do I like these books? Man, why not? Here Paul is writing to Timothy, protege. Paul calls him my true son in the faith. That would be cool that Paul call you that but that's what he's talking about and 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 Paul in writing these letters these two letters first and second Timothy to Timothy he's trying to get him to understand that hey there's there's a lot of work that needs to be done and there's some good things and I need you to stay faithful in them now listen to what he says here and I'm I'm gonna be in first Timothy and uh Paul writes this, 1 Timothy chapter 1, and he says this, And I urge you when you went into Macedonia to st uh, stay there in Ephesus so that you may command certain men to not to teach false doctrines any longer, nor to devote themselves to myths and endless genealogies. They promote controversies rather than God's work, which is by faith. The goal of this, uh, this command is love, which comes from a pure heart and a good conscience and a sincere faith. Some have wandered away from these and turned to meaningless talks. They want to be teachers of the law, but they do not know what they are talking about or what they so confidently affirm. And here, here's what Paul is trying to get Timothy to understand. He's like, hey, there's, there's people that are in the church that are talking about things that aren't from here. 
They sound good, but they're not from here. They, they're convincing others to, to follow. They're not from here. From here. We get stuck on things that aren't from here. And it's controversies. It's meaningless. Because it's not from here. It's gotta be from here. All right. I'm excited for Sunday. I'm excited for next Sunday. Let's all get together on Sunday and praise him and glorify him and honor him and, and uh, celebrate being a mom. Celebrate being a mother or a grandmother. Love you guys. I will see you Sunday. All right. Bye, everybody.